Hi, I'm Jacob. Hi, I'm McKinsey. And this is Study Time's Level 1 Science Top Tips. We're going to start today with acids and bases. How do your resources relate to that valence electron shells? I'm talking about the periodic table and the table of ions. These are so important for understanding how to balance equations and how to use that swap and drop method, which is half of your paper. What is also really important for the standard is pH. We need to know how both universal indicator and litmus paper shows up on both an acid and a base, knowing these colours and how it relates to the spectrum. Moving on to mechanics. The main thing here is this is a problem solving exam. You don't need to remember anything except the units for the formula. The main thing here is knowing how the formula relate to each other. Right, this is really important for that excellence question. They're going to ask you to use different formula to figure out that final answer. So you need to treat it like a step by step process. Lastly is genetics. Now for genetics, what we need to know is how to read a pedigree chart and how to fill in a Punnett square. This is really important and it really helps us with those long answer questions. What is also really important for the standard is definitions. Definitions always are the beginning of our long answer questions and always form the basis of the argument that we're making. What is also really important is that we use these definitions to differentiate all the nitty gritty stuff that is in the standard. But don't forget about sexual reproduction and how it relates to variation. This is really important for understanding that entire genetic process. This has been Study Time's Level 1 Science Top Tips. For more information, check out our walkthrough online.